Sorry, brother. Kiosk. Ready to go, pal. Jer and Mike's Algonquin Excellent Adventure. See ya. Turning out all the bugs with the portage. It's our first portage, so uh Literally, ironing out the bugs, I just got bit by a mosquito. <laughs> yeah, they're starting. So, uh, Jeremy's doing the food barrel and uh, his bag, and I'm doing my bag in the canoe. So, yep, we're just uh, figuring out all the good stuff here. There it is. See you at the other end. Split the difference. Woo! Nice, eh? Hey, what am I hooked on? What Nothing. Beautiful day out here. Just absolutely amazing. Halfway. That canoe weighs 67 pounds. Plus, the paddles are attached to it. So we stopped, we dropped everything, and we're going to carry our uh, canoe packs over, go back and get the canoe and food. That's what we're doing. Wow.
laziest portage ever. <laughs> this part of the video, or this chapter, is called Portage Adversity. Clickety, clackety, clickety, clackety, clickety, clackety. Why? Down on that one. Well, that's it for portages for today. Time to uh, head to the campsite. Throw up a hammock. How's it going, brother? Sweaty. Sweaty. There was a big steaming hot bear poop right at the beginning of the trail. We both missed it the first time around. Is that right? Big. Like. Um, Keeper of a bear poop. Any any uh, portagers or wrappers in it? Not a one. Mouse Lake. We have found home. Just walked up from the beach where we put the canoe, and there is nobody here. This is our home for tonight. Look at this beautiful sandy beach. Well, supper is just about ready. Um, I'm just uh, rehydrating everything in the pot cozies. Take a and look. Here I've got the rice cooking. Uh, it's going along very well. I've got the TVP cooking. Um, I've rehydrated the vegetables and broth. Some assembly required. Hi rehydrated vegetables, rice, basmati rice, and TVP and special spices. Yum. If only you could smell it. Our own little oasis. But uh, we worked for it. That's right. We worked for this. We worked hard. And now we got full bellies. Yep. And we're happy boys on the beach. We're fully, fully, fully appreciating this moment. It's uh, 6 o'clock a.m. I don't think I've ever slept better in my entire life. It rained all night. 
So, uh, yeah, it, uh, it was very soothing. Lens woke me up. There's the uh, overnight oats, ready to go. Just gonna add the icing on the cake. And gonna do some quick coffee business. Couple of nice dry spots. And one clean one. <laughs> Visitor last night. We had an Algonquin wolf. How cool. Based. So we further inspected the uh, wolf tracks and what we discovered was there was a couple sets of very small tracks as well. So what we realized it was a mom and her pups. So that was pretty cool. We had a, that's cool. That is just mind blowing cool. to you that we always wear life jackets except it's as calm as I've ever seen it and we're not going far so just a quick jaunt life jackets always have a 67 pound canoe you double carry on long portages I don't care if you're a bull or not I'm not <laughs> hi ho hi ho back to get the food and canoe we go how you feeling buddy awesome we're killing it killing it stop at this campsite, take a break, have some lunch before we go hit the big 1500 meter port. Good call on Jeremy, where we uh, stopped at this campsite on Big Thunder Lake just for a quick lunch before we do the next big portage. And uh, this site is absolutely amazing. It's really cool. Check this out. Nice fire pit. Had, it looks like a guy had a tarp over here, dry spot, but it's an amazing view. Big Thunder Lake, it's a one campsite lake, but it's, if you can get it, get it. Ingredients, potatoes, carrots, coconut milk, lentils, onions, peas, Corn, olive oil, sun-dried tomatoes, garlic, spices, sea salt, certified organic ingredients. Still not vegan.
Big Thunder. Lots of leeches in the Big lake. Leeches. Lots of leeches. We just had to get them off our legs. There's a whole pile of them. Here. Oh. Right on the left. Oh. Right on the left. In there. Little baby leeches. Everywhere. Let's mess with them. Here, here. Oh. Oh. Little bastard, eh? Hi ho, back to get the canoe we go. <laughs> Jeremy's sucking my farts. Good thing I'm Delicious. vegan. He's vegan. Yeah, plant based. They don't smell. Yeah, right. Jeremy. Really? Sorry, bud. Huh? Nature called, I had to answer. Pretty much all set up for the night. Uh, we're on Erebles, Erebles Lake. Um, I think it was French for Maple, with, but Maple Lake is one over. Anyways, this is where we are. Let's take a tour. <laughs> Mr. Beers. Good day. You look pretty cozy. Oh. Yeah. We worked for this today, buddy. Yeah, what did we do? Like uh, 12 kilometers of portage? 12K. Yeah, that was a good one. Yeah. Time to sit down. <laughs> yeah. He was nice at home there. My hammock's head up. Jeremy's back there. We also put up a nice big tarp. We're actually drying everything out as well. Everything was still pretty wet this morning. But uh, we got a beautiful panoramic vista here with a small island in front of us.
Hey man, good morning. Morning, sunshine. <laughs> Looks like it's a tarp party. It's a tarp party today. Oh wow. Things got a little freaky last night. Holy moly. Thunder, lightning, one crazy owl that I thought was snuggling with you because he was that close. <laughs> it's a good night. Clothes got put on the wash cycle. That's good. Cheers, bro. Cheers, brother. It's gonna be a rumble. It happened. <sighs> Sunlight. Yeah, today is day three, and today is rest day we're gonna paddle around the lake here arables lake we're gonna look for a good uh, swimming spot go swimming hashtag still not vegan hi ho hi ho hi ho hi ho 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 it's off to cutwood we go hi ho 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 That right behind our campsite is an old growth forest. Some of these trees are, and they say, are over 200 years old, I believe it. Some big guys. Huge. How cool is that? Look up. Look way up. Thank you, Mr. Beaver, for a couple of sticks. Now get busy. <laughs> Bushcraft Jeremy. Sunshine. Cutting all the wood. Damn. Hey, we are doing buffet style, rest day buffet style. Daya, mac and cheese. Basmati rice, TVP, veggies, and soup mix. Wraps with the special 
spice mix. You're seriously trying to empty my bowels, aren't you? <laughs> I'm gonna turn you into a vegan. You're gonna try. <laughs> veggies, basmati rice, TVP, mac and cheese, all going on a wrap. Bottoms up. Jeremy's doing the assembly. <laughs> Jeremy. Yes, sir? How was that? Oh my God, that was delicious. Not bad for a uh, rest day buffet, eh? Yeah, not bad at all. Yum. Mm. Macaroni and cheese. Hmm. And for the next person that arrives on the site, we've got everything ready to go for you. sunrise but uh, we have a orange sun at morn the wind is coming from the south and we don't have a very big day but we want to get to our portages soon finish our coffees pack up camp see you later
right, we did our final walk around here. Didn't forget anything, didn't leave anything. We had a rest day here, so we really put some work in on the site and cleaned it up real good. Everything's good. Everything's good. Paddle on. You paddle like you're in the back of the boat. <laughs> Somebody's got a steer while you shoot video. <laughs> Damn it, always shooting video, eh? Always shooting video. Would you hurry up? <laughs> 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 and at our first portage, there are some wolf tracks. We got the wind on our back. We're going downstream and it's all downhill. Perfect day. So now we're on the portage on Maple Creek, the 800 meter. And uh, luckily it's not uphill, but check this out.
Oh yeah, it's down there. Yeehaw! Damn. Ain't no thing but a chicken wing. These nuts. If you've got a ridiculously oversized, almost comedically heavy barrel, throw your canoe pack on top just to make portages twice as painful. Now we're a day ahead. We ripped it through there. So tomorrow is another rest day. Yeah! Well, we uh, finished our trip, our six day trip, in four days. How awesome is that? We went like powerhouses today. We thought we would just bulldoze through the rest of the way, which wasn't a lot really, but um, we cranked it all the way back to Kiosk Lake and um, stopped at a couple sites along the way. It's uh, the day after the long weekend and uh, sites are a little, a little bit tattered right now. So we just decided let's go right back to the truck, treat ourselves to a Tim Horton and make the six hour drive home. And we could be in our own beds tonight. <laughs>